I try to relax myself. I'm a jokester, a prankster, if you want to say it that way. I try to, I listen to music, I joke around with the guys, I take my whole mind away from the game itself, and then when the time comes to focus on the game, I focus on my skills, my skills, my skills. At the end of the day, it's not about the fog. It's about what the fog represents. Think of the fog as a cloak around you. A cloak just covering the area. A cloak over your vision, a cloak over your brain. And that's everything in your circle, everything that's around you. Your social media presence, what's on social media. Your immediate circle, your circle in school your circle in your job, whatever it may be, that's around you, that's circling you, that has influence over you. Just like this, the fog coats everything, the rain coats everything. The coating, the coating of those things is gonna have an impact on you and how you see the outside world and how you act. Now, as you can see, there's not too many people out right now. And that's because it's rainy, it's a moody day, it's kind of grimy, it's wet. It's not an ideal day. And that's the same effect people can have on you if they're having a bad mood. And this is the thing. A lot of people are victims of their emotions. It's, it's, it's good because emotions can be a powerful thing. It could drive you to do very good things. Help your family, whatever it may be. Help your friends. But you can't be driven by these things because it could also lead to your destruction as well. But, let's get back into the fog. Now I say this like this may be an easy thing, but it really isn't. Going into the unknown, it has its own sort of tasks along with it. It has its own sort of roadblocks, its own sort of things you gotta get over. It's not gonna be easy, it's a lot of failing. But, you know, what's better? Living your life and fear or living the life you could have lived and you can live and you could do so now. Now we've all heard the saying, the, pay, the price you'll pay for living that way is the price you could have lived. And that price is just way too high, man. No one should pass that up. You gotta, you gotta go after it no matter what. If you have a car, think of yourself as a car. If you have a car, And you're so afraid to drive it. You just, there's, you're not gonna get any use out of the car. You're not gonna get the enjoyment out of the car. The ups and downs, the braking, the fixing, all the stuff that comes with it. You're not gonna get that out of the car. And that's life. There's ups and downs. But you just have to keep going. You have to use the car. You're just gonna let the car sit and rock. That's not how it works, man. That's not how it works. Like a car, you can't preserve your life. You have to keep going. You have to drive it. You have to use it. You have to squeeze everything out of it. See what it's capable of. A lot of people are walking around afraid to put gas in their car because they think the price is too high. Well, you're gonna find out that price real soon. It's gonna be more than gas.